everyone! Welcome back to my channel, and welcome to part two of my Toma Pet Let's Play. In part one, we left off on day two, selling some of our vegetables. Today is still day two, and we're about to head back to the gardening store for more supplies. And let's go... Hmm, I'm actually not sure how much... how many coins I have left. Let's go with a couple of apple seeds. And we will just leave this here for a few hours then. But let's go back and do a few more hours of school because that is my big goal is to make sure I can get the top job for this Toma pet. The first generation of the pet that I ran, I did not have the top job. I actually didn't have any graduation caps. So I was only making 20 coins per job, which... I guess the highest paying job with all the graduation caps will pay 100 coins, so that's a huge difference. I will show you the jobs more when that time comes, but for today, um, we just need to focus on going to school and doing a good job. However, I'll admit it absolutely drives me crazy that I have to walk back to school every single stinking time I need to take a class. Honestly, that is... One of my biggest pet peeves with the Toma Pet is that you just can't skip through things. Things take a little bit longer to do than a Bandai Tamagotchi. So I guess since I said my least favorite things about the Toma Pet so far, which would be the slowness and how much money um, and coins it takes to take care of the pet, my favorite things are... Probably the quality of screen. Unfortunately, there doesn't seem to be a way to turn down the screen brightness, but I'm happy with the brightness that it's preset at. The other thing I'm pretty happy with is the rechargeable battery. So when the Tomo Pet came to me, the battery was charged, and I think I played the pet for, was it five days? Five days or six days, and the battery was just fine. Then one day it started beeping like crazy and oh I <laughs> I don't know math very well. Um it started beeping like crazy and um it had a flashing battery icon in the corner of the screen. So I plugged it in and it only took about an hour to charge it again. And then things were back to normal, and that was, I think, Sunday that I charged it. So the day before I started doing this vlog, and so that seems to be a really nice feature. However, I am a little worried about the battery, because someone that wrote a review for this Toma Pet on Amazon, they said that one of the times that they charged their pet, it just started smoking. So, um... That would be bad. <laughs> I really don't want that to happen with mine, but so far, so good. Let's also visit one of these other going out options today. This here is the um, house customization store, I guess you could call it. <laughs> the home improvement store. Now, I don't want to spend any of my gold on these projects right now, but I can show you what's available. So, you can remodel all of the rooms in your house. So these are, of course, different places for your living room. Then this is the kitchen. Then the bathroom, of course. There are a few different places. That one kind of looks like a basketball hoop. And then lastly, the bathtub, which is the same as the bathroom, but different. <laughs> you could have different wallpapers for your bathtub versus your toilet room, I suppose. And yeah, those are the options for remodeling. Again, I'm not going to change anything today because I don't want to spend my coins on them, but maybe in the future. Let's take one more quick look at my stats before we go for the day. I actually have a tiny bit of happiness, probably from spending that, that uh, 20 points to go to the park. Again, my hunger is not nearly as full as it possibly could be. Um, I only have 560 coins right now, so that's basically enough food to keep the Toma Pet alive for another day. However, I figured it's I figured out it's actually really, really hard to kill this pet 
last week when I was doing my trial run and I was sick of it, I didn't feed it for like three days and it, it didn't care. <laughs> it just, it of course wasn't happy, but it wasn't dead. Anyways, and then I did finally get my second graduation cap from the math game. Hopefully tomorrow we can finish getting the graduation caps. It is now Wednesday. Thank God we are finally halfway through this super long, long week. I don't know if I mentioned this earlier. I don't think I did. Jake and I were actually supposed to go on vacation this week, but there was some conflicts with work scheduling on his part, so we had to reschedule things. So right now it's just like, <laughs> I'm supposed to be away from here on vacation and not working right now, but that's okay. We will get to go on vacation soon, so no need to worry, I suppose. Anyways, nothing is super new with the Toma Pet. I've been working really hard to make sure I get all the graduation caps, the full education level, and I think right now I'm at four. I've probably been answering the questions for about a half hour today, and I've gained a couple more caps, but... I just need to get that last one. And it's it's very interesting. The questions go from being uh, not necessarily hard, but more challenging addition and multiplication questions to the super basics, like one plus one. So it's kind of weird. All right, yep, so it looks like I do need one more cap. Before we keep working on that though, let's go check our garden. Let's see here. Looks like we don't have anything to sell at the moment, so we just need to see what we are already have planted, which I think was an apple tree, maybe. Yes, indeed, the apple tree. I'm not sure how much the apple will get us, but I'm hoping 400, I think. And yep, 400 gold for an apple. But yeah, so for the rest of the day, that's just my plan to keep working on the education. I will probably harvest that apple later tonight. I probably won't wait until tomorrow because the gardening does really help with money. Uh, but that's really it for today, and I will check in with you all tomorrow. It is now day four, and just a little bit ago, my Toma pet evolved into an adult, which is super exciting because... I love that as an adult, you can send your pet to work, and that's a super easy way to make money. I'm actually going to turn the sound on right now. When I have my pet go to work, I like to use the sound, um, I guess you could say as a reminder. I'll show you here. Okay, so when I go to work, I listen for the sound. And those couple of clicks tells me it's time to send my pet back to work. Basically, when I'm, you know, around um, my house doing chores or if I'm working on the computer, I can just keep hitting the button to send the pet to work. And those three clicks tell me that it's time to send them again. So as much as I really don't like the sound, I do keep it on quite often just so I can um, use a little trick like this to help my pet earn a lot of money pretty quickly. But enough of that. I think I think I'm going to go ahead and turn it back off once again. And you know, to be perfectly honest, I don't think I'm going to marry the Toma pet again. As much as I've enjoyed learning about this pet, it's not my favorite. I don't think it's ever going to be one of my favorites either. It's interesting and there are some features that I like about it, but overall it's in kind of lacking the charm of Tamagotchi that I really enjoy. <laughs> as much as I hate to say it, I think from here I am just going to put my Toma Pet back in its box and put the box in my collection drawer. And that sounds really sad, that's not a very good way to end the video, but I, I'm just trying to be honest because I've had some people ask me if I would recommend this, and I'm going to make a separate review video about it so I can give a more lengthy and in-depth answer. So if you haven't already, I'd really appreciate it if you would subscribe so you don't miss that review video. Then next, I have some more Tamagotchi videos in the works. 
You can also find me on Instagram and Twitter, as well as on Discord, where we have a server set up for chat about Tamagotchi, collecting toys, and anything else you feel like talking about. Again, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video!